Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. Well, David Benavidez, he won the fight. He did what he had to do. He missed weight, lost his title. So it kind of took some air out of this title fight. And I didn't really like how the Showtime, it was just seemed too quiet. I like the PBC version on Fox a little bit better. It seems as though it was more lively. I like the, the pictures in the background. I like the crowd noise whenever they had it in there. It just seemed a little bit more lively. But back to the fight, Benavidez came in here and did what he had to do. He should have made weight so it could have been even more exciting. He hit Angulo with everything he needed to hit him with. I wish maybe three rounds earlier, he would have just sat down on his punches and did what he did in the 10th round. If he would have did that earlier, he could have got Angulo up out of here quicker than he did. But I think he was pacing himself. He was making sure that he didn't get hit with anything silly. And so by doing so, he was able to break Angulo down. Angulo, he, he, I mean, he's a tough guy. Let's just say he has heart. He came in here. He did what he thought he could do, but it was not enough. Um, one thing that Benavidez did do is he did stop him and no one has stopped him like that before. So he did do that right. Now, if Caleb Plant was standing in front of David Benavidez, this version of it, would Caleb Plant win tonight? Some say that he probably would win tonight. Some say no, David Benavidez would have won. Caleb Plant would have been sharp. He wouldn't have allowed him to rest. He would have pressed him and it would have been a completely different fight. But because he lost the belt, got stripped by coming overweight, we will not know this until sometime, hopefully next year, we'll see. What do you think about David Benavidez's performance? Do you think he did enough? Or do you think he could have done better? Let me know what you think until next time. It's Pedro Justice.